What's up guys, Elote here, bringing you guys episode 2 of our Beating the Campaign series. And as you guys saw from the beginning, we do have a brand new outro. It is, I think, a little longer than the old one, but I like the new style. Like, might as well put a new outro with the new, like, redesign of everything we have. So yeah, um, right than that, we are on episode 2 of our Beating the Camp Campaign series. I, I'm, I know for sure we're going to have a brand new thumbnail because I don't like the old thumbnail. It's like, it seems like there's a lot on the screen. So we'll probably like have a blank image in the back and stuff like that. Or like a solid color like the other thumbnails we have. But yeah, let's get right into this. So since we did do the first technically from Payback all the way to Rocky Fort, we are on Goblin Gauntlet. And I, I'm pretty sure we have we should have Bart. So this is number five in the campaign, technically. So in this one, so yeah, we have our Bart like always. This one you get so, this is why, like, since we have no time limit in here, um, in campaign, we could take as long as we want to explain everything. So we have one, um, <laughs> one cannon on the right and one cannon on the left. So that's pretty easy to take out. All you gotta do is, well, I would say, put three barbers on each side. One, two, three. One, two, three. And that will, no matter what, one one barb on each side will take. As much damage as possible while the rest of the barbs go in and take out the cannons so from here you basically don't really have to do anything else because all they have to do is go run through the base and basically take out the remaining building which is not that many so yeah there are some bombs here and there like some surprise bombs i think there's a surprise bomb right there and yeah there you go but that's all right because you basically don't have to put any more trivia you can put like a arch or something back here like behind the main building so you could just get the easy uh one star like that but might as well just go in and start everything else so yeah that's this one was pretty easy you could just do it with a couple of barbs um well most of them you could do with just a couple of bars for this one especially but yeah um let's get right into that's five this is number six <laughs> sorry um next is cannonball run see what this one has in store so this one has two cannons on the inside on the top and bottom technically and one right at the far right at the bottom of single cannon they seem like they're a little i think still level one i'm not sure or they're level two but yeah in this one there are a few empty spaces like by those torches and you basically just have to take everything out um you could easily for this one i would even though it's not recommended to do that mainly in multiplayer, but I think you quite is actually good enough to do actually use those empty spaces as an advantage. But since we're not gonna do that, we're gonna put like two bars right here and put two arches behind to take out that our uh, cannon while the barbs take out the wall. So after this, once they take out the cannon, let's see, what, let's see where they head. So they head towards the middle. So that's when the other cannon starts striking. So you put two next to each again and put two more archers behind them it might be a little too much but it gets the job done quicker so yeah we have that one archer already at the bottom couple archers at the bottom taking out the middle building with that one barbarian the rest of the troops are just wiping out the rest of the base pretty easily so this one doesn't require as many troops not not yet pretty simple but yeah here we go three stars on cannonball run and number six in the campaign is done so i think we're gonna do we're gonna we're probably gonna stick with three for each episode that way we go have more episodes as you guys because they have the whole campaign done. but yeah um we are on two smoking barrels this is what one two three four five six number seven in the campaign so this will be the third one of this video the last one because the last one we basically did three videos so so yeah, let's get this attack started. So in this one, as you guys can see, there's a, I think level one cannon on the top, and I'm not sure if there's level two or three cannon at the bottom. Basically simple defending. I don't know why it's connection lost. It's being weird. But yeah, this is, I can see this one's a little simple. I think these lines right here are, what's it called? Like these side lines are filled with bombs here and there. I'm not sure how many, but we could usually just break in the middle so this put one two three and one two three on top and on the bottom and put two archers behind them so this will basically you know distract the cannons 
and it'll be easier for us to take out the middle building, which is like the town hall, I could say. So you see those barbs going on the side. There are some bombs, but we're already in the main part of the base. So here we go. We got two stars already and just got three quick buildings left to take down, which isn't going to take that much with this number of troops. So yeah, there we go. And boom. There we go, three stars on two smoking barrels. So that I think that that's gonna be it for the video guys. That's what three three different bases um that we've done so far. So now we're at one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. So so far we completed seven. So this was what like I think four through seven. So three three attacks this time, three campaign maps, and that will be it because I'm going to keep it uh, at least two or three for every video. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Please leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already seen more Clash of Clans content on the channel. And with that, hope to see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.